Imagine for a second what it's like to be blind. I'm talking a total blackout. But then finally able to see light thanks to a tiny implant. Might not look like much to us, but it is a game changer thanks to a couple of doctors right here in Houston. Melissa Correa gives us a look at the bionic eye. Our bionic eye. As much as I love the bionic eye. So the bionic eye. Let's start with the obvious. Lee Majors is in some good company. So when we say bionic eye, this is a special, exciting new technology that allows us to actually help people that can't see at all. From a total blackout to being able to see lights and shapes, doctors Amir Mosinin and Garvin Davis are making Houston proud. I mean, how cool was this? Did either of you call your mom? I mean, what? Oh, of <laughs> <Come> course. <on. laughs> of course. <laughs> called mom, <laughs> shared videos. Like that. Like this one, this is one of their first patients. And so you can see when she scans just the dots of light that she's seeing. Second sight makes the only FDA approved retinal prosthesis or bionic eye. It's too small to show you and it attaches to the surface of your retina and the inside of your eye. That implant then communicates with that camera and this little box, which sends the image back to the implant. It's pretty fascinating. It is something that only the patient sees. This is the only place in Texas and really the Gulf Coast that offers it. And yeah, there's a wait list. They're going to be merging this with artificial intelligence. It's like an perhaps. Uh, yeah, and it is. you know, yeah. you're going to they're going to look at ther they're thinking about putting thermal sensors so you can detect heat. There's also hope that this technology can be used to help other people who lose their vision like trauma victims and diabetics. Hope in 20 years we look back and you know, this was we look back and say this was just the beginning. The doctors say you cannot hack into the technology. Insurance covers the implant and the surgery and the user can and turn the glasses on and off. <laughs> yes, it's Because uh, it, let's uh, be honest, there's some things in this world we just don't want to see. Yes, it actually, exactly. the technology actually started from the cochlear implant for mm -hmm. hearing. Just a couple of bionic buddies. It's amazing how much we all rely on our sight and we take it for granted until we lose it. With their sights set on improving lives. Standing for Houston, Melissa Correa, KHOU 11 News. The future is now. And you can read much more about it on our website, khu.com.